Remember how the lines were real, real long? Oh, sure. But then they had, they had, they had sections. The, they didn't mail the checks. You had to go I, down I, to the I union. I remember that. Yeah. But they had, they had set, separate, uh, for people that worked a lot, like Sip and I, they had, we had our own files. So they separated the checks and put them in our own files. So I'm standing at the window, and I had my file, and who's next to me was Tony. Tony Turan. Tony Turan. And Tony, you know, loved to gamble, man. He and Tom. And Tom, you remember, he had a... He had a marker up in uh, Vegas, remember? He'd go up yeah. there, they would treat him like, um, he'd, he'd go up every week. He'd go up there and then had carte blanche. Everything was carte blanche for Tommy. So now, Tommy's there as well, but Tony's there. And Tony says to me, he says, hey, Chuck. He says, yeah, he says, um, he says, I'll flip for one of your checks. I said, well, you know, because we had a stack of checks. I said, okay, well, like, well no, not too much, because I'm not a gambler. I said, not too much. I said, okay, something in the 60s, you know. So I said, well, here's a... Here's a jingle check for sixty-two dollars and change. So well, I got one here too, you know. So I said, well, okay, let's do it. You know, and I didn't want to do it, but Tony was so adamant about it. So he takes the coin and he flips, and I won, and I win the check, his check. And I said, no, don't know, Tony. It's okay. He said, no, no, you won it fair and square, and he gave me the check. You know, but then he wanted to gamble again. I said, "No, that's it. No, I mean that's a, it's a one-time deal." You, you know? beat him. Yeah, one time. I love that. Yeah, Tony was great. Well, you know, remember where Desi Lou was on, yeah. on Gower? Mm -hmm. Sure, I worked there. Yeah, and on a ten, Tony would run to the union. Right, well, he'd Gower, run. He'd run to the union, run. make it back Not in, in the time car. He would run. Yeah, he, he would run, run yeah, all the way to the union. Yeah, you know, that's the first session I did was at that studio, and it was really? for Lassie. And oh it was yeah, Nathan that's Scott. Only Nathan Scott. Nathan yeah. Scott. And it was me and Tony Turan. You know, my first TV show in this town was with Nathan Scott. That was my first. My first. It was, and it was the last time my oboe teacher got hung up, he, and he sent me in, and I was new. And Nathan was so nice to was me. He, beautiful? he was so different than Tom. Oh yeah, he was so laid back. <laughs> Tom was <laughs> and cool because Tom. Ah, this was made film. Good. <laughs> Tom, yeah, 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 yeah. Tom was on the call too. Oh, I met Tommy, but I met Tommy before that. The first session I did, I was living in Vegas after I left Buddy's band, and I flew down to do uh, at um, Liberty Records. Um, um, it was, um, I think, for it was an album for Groove Homes. Was Dave Bell the producer? No, no, it wasn't. It was Groove Homes. It was who was uh, the head of A and R over there? It was Pacific World, the, the jazz. World Pacific, oh. which was a, a subsidiary of Liberty Records. You remember, you know the studio. Big box. studio. Yeah. So I flew down and did this. So they tell me that I fly down, first of all. Then I take a taxi from LAX to the studio. It cost me like $35 back then, or whatever it was. And it was the wrong day. It was the wrong week. It was the following <laughs> week. So I had to fly home. They gave me the wrong day. Oh. That's for starters. So the next week I fly down again. And it's uh, Tommy's on it, and Gabe Baltazar was oh, on it. Oh, Gabe Baltazar. And, yeah. uh, and Joe Sample, and Joe, it was Joe's first horn arrangements, and it was for uh, Groove Homes, Richard Groove Homes. And that's when I met Tommy, and we were, we were really little kids. And then when I moved down the year later, that's when I worked with Tommy at the uh, You're talking about Tedesco. No, oh, Scott. Scott. Tom Scott. Tom Scott, yeah, yeah. yeah. And then, then, we, uh, then I worked with the his dad, with Lassie, now. and Tommy was on that call. Yeah, yeah. You were probably. You I was on Tom on first call. call at Universal. You were probably on that call there too with uh, for Lassie. Maybe. You may have been there. 